I think this is starting to get to me. What's up guys, Jason here, aspiring entrepreneur, showing you the day in the life of a budding entrepreneur, the hustle building business, the grind of creating content. And right now I am right smack dab in the middle of this content grind, you know, two videos a day. And I gotta tell you, it's it's really getting to me. I mean, I was able to record a bunch of videos, you know, a few days ago, and I'm still recovering from all that energy output. I mean, one of the things I think that it's really difficult to manage as entrepreneurs is energy, right? We can have the best task lists and the best, you know, time blocking plans in the world, but if you sit down at your computer and you're just dead, right? your brain is just off someplace else, went on vacation because you pushed it too hard, uh, it's really hard to stick to that schedule. And so it's definitely not an excuse to be like, oh, I don't feel like it today. Because I think there's a difference between not being motivated and legitimately being exhausted because you've just pushed yourself uh, a little too hard in some areas. And so one of the things I'm learning through this content challenge that I'm sharing with you right now is the fact that when you put together your tasks or you put together your time blocks, give a little bit of thought to how much energy each one of those tasks or time blocks takes, right? We've all heard, you know, do the super hard stuff in the morning and do the easy stuff in the afternoon. And I think on a micro level that works, but then also on a macro level, think about the number of days you're working, right? I'm at six, averaging six and a half, you know, work days a week right now. So that plus the gym, maybe I should have laid off the gym and the swimming for a little bit just so I could help my body recover. And so this isn't a complaining, you know, segment or saying, hey, you know, it's totally fine. Take the day off. You're tired. No, if you're tired and you scheduled yourself to do something that's even more exhausting, like today I have two and a half videos to edit. I still have to do it. You still have to do it. But what's important is that we learn from days like today where you're just like, I am exhausted because there's a difference between exhaustion and, you know, not feeling like it. So it's one of those things, learn from it. And then in the future, schedule out differently so that you're actually working with the grain of however your energy levels go in terms of, you know, what drains your energy and what gives you energy. If I had to play with Excel sheets all day, wouldn't matter how tired I was. I would always have energy to do that. But when it comes to video editing or recording, eh, I don't always have the energy to do that. So it's just important to be cognizant of your energy and managing your energy in addition to all the tasks you have. So with that, it's time for me to jump into the content grind for the day, edit and post these videos. And done. Grind is over. Yes, my day was really as boring as this vlog, but you know what? That's kind of the point because it really does look boring like this. I mean, you do have boring days like this where all you do is sit in front of the computer. I know I've said that before and I will keep saying it over and over and over again because this is what the content grind looks like in the beginning. I hope eventually in, I don't know, six or nine months we can Look at look back at this and be like, oh wow, now I can see how how that all paid off. But for now, it's just a grind. It's kind of like having your head in the sand. And you're just going, 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 going. You're not really looking up, and that's what these days look like. And that's what it takes to produce the amount of content that I'm uh, <laughs> that I'm producing. And it's laying a strong foundation for a solid content on uh, marketing style sales funnel that you guys will see grow into the future. So until the next video, keep hustling, keep grinding, and of course, keep building the business you love. Take care.